This is day nine at the uh, Chris Orser Landscaping Retaining Wall Project, and the crew just got uh, done today. So um, all the grading is done, um, all the degrading behind the wall is done. They installed the uh, low voltage lights, put in the capstones, um, put back any plants that were uh, transplanted at the beginning, um, and it's just a great looking wall. I mean, it's natural PA field zone, just a, a great way to, to go with a retaining wall. Um, you can see the plants, the junipers kind of cascading here over the, over the wall, adding a dramatic effect to it. Um, same thing here on the other side as we pan down here. Uh, more junipers cascading over, just adds another um, natural element to the stone and makes it more naturalistic. The dianthus here, once the spring hits, um, once, it, once the dianthus starts to grow, that'll kind of creep over. Um, <clears throat> all the, the plants, again, that were transplanted in the beginning um, are all back. Uh, we put a nice edge uh, along the bed so when we mulch this in the spring, it'll be ready to go. Um, the drainage pipe is buried, so again, when, when it rains and the water comes down the hill, it hits the, the drainage stone that we put behind the retaining wall, goes into the pipe, um, follows the pipe down to the existing system that they had in place and exits out uh, in the street, alleviating any, a, lot of the, a lot of the water pressure and the soil pressure behind the wall. So this wall is going to be here for a very, very, very long time. Um, but the wall just looks great. And this is a close-up of the... Um, low voltage lighting that we put in. Um, we didn't spec it originally, but as this wall was being built, we thought that it would be uh, a great feature to have since uh, the homeowner had existing low voltage lights above the wall. Uh, we figured it'd be a really nice uh, touch to add low voltage lighting actually in the wall. Um, so you can see it at night too. It looks great during the day, and when these lights are lit up at night, it's going to look great at night too. So. Um, the homeowner is going to enjoy it day and night. And this is just one of the small details that goes into every, every project that Chris Ross or landscaping. You know, as we build the uh, hardscape or landscape, uh, if we see something that's going to add um, uh, value to the project, we will tell you about it. And, you know, the decision's yours whether or not to do it, but we're, we're always going to tell you. Um, we're always in touch with the, with the client to tell you what's going on. Um, and you know, one of the main goals at Chris Orser Landscaping is to make the client happy. Um, we're here to serve the client. Um, we're available all day long, seven days a week. Um, but this, this is an example here of the low voltage lighting. It just adds a really subtle, nice touch to the wall. And it's, it's really gonna go a long way at night. And uh, the next thing we're going to do is actually come back at night when these lights are on and show you the wall at night to, to show you how great it looks at night time um, with, the, with the lights behind the wall and with the, with the lights in the wall. It's really going to add a really nice touch to it. So um, if you want to get a hold of Chris Orser Landscaping, 215-249-1236, or you can get a hold of us on the website at www.orserlandscaping.com. Or, excuse me, orserlandscaping.com. He said again, uh, www.orserlandscaping.com.